In this video, I'll show you how to add a quantity label before the quantity field on your WooCommerce store in just a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Throughout this video, I'm going to show you how you can add a label in front of the quantity field like this. So you could say something like packs um, or even quantity just to make it more clear. Whatever you want, you can add it there. Okay. And this video is based on this particular blog post here on the AOVOP.com blog. So I'll leave a link in the description below because you will need to copy and paste the code onto your website okay so we'll scroll down and then we'll copy the first bit of code here which is this action hook so let's go ahead and copy this here and then we'll head over to our website to add this code you can add it to your themes functions.php file to a code snippet plugin or even to a child theme i'll leave a video and the link on screen to a particular video showing you where and how you can add these codes to your website okay so for this example i'm just going to add it directly to my themes functions.php file so let's head over to our dashboard and then i'm going to navigate over to appearance and then theme file editor Whenever you're adding or modifying any code in your website, I personally recommend just creating a backup first, okay? Head over to functions.php and then we'll just scroll down and we'll add this code to the bottom of the page, okay? So let's paste in this code here. I'm just going to leave a note to let us know what this code's for. So I'm going to say slash and then star and then star and then slash again to close it out. And then in between these stars, we're going to say, so we're just going to say something like adding quantity label, okay? and then let's head back over to the blog post and then we'll copy the rest of the code okay so we'll copy this bit of the code here and then we'll go ahead and paste it below the first line of code we added and here where it says quantity you can change the name to whatever you want so you could say packs or even units you can change it to anything you want so i'm just going to save changes okay so that's saved fine so now when we actually view one of our products, we'll be able to see that label before the quantity input field. So let's just quickly view one of our products now. Okay, and here you can see our label, which says quantity, and then a the customer can just go ahead and choose the quantity they require, okay? And that's a quick and simple way to add a label in front of the quantity field. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave it in the comment box below or reach out to support and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.